classic wholesome fun. Deku's on deck now. Had a we're, great We're going to get some more Ganon, and uh, we're keeping to the store. We got a Toon Link versus a, a uh, well, I guess an Ocarina Ganon. Almost a story. It, it's one of those close enough sort of moments. So this will be interesting to see how he handles a character that has projectiles. Um, I know Lucario has the Shadow Ball, but that's one little slow projectile. Uh, a big part of it is kind of closing the gap more than anything else. Ooh. Getting around some of the walls. That's when he's going to be able to find a lot of openings. Because Apathy, I think above everything else, with those low percents, probably just wants to keep Deku's at bay and then when he comes in, start punishing uh, with the dish room. But Deku is able to get past the wall quickly, then we can see some really big damage coming out. Ooh. The slick get to the edge, securing that. So the bombs are good to, for just opening up. Honestly, any of those projectiles are kind of good for opening it up. Opening your offense up. And you saw that we were talking about the bombs. Yeah. That was, what, two bombs and a boomerang, and then he got a couple up airs. Put some good juicy percent there on Deku's. And like we said, UNC crew. I think that Deku's has had the, uh, the time to play against Abney before. So it's not a matchup where uh, he has some unfamiliarities. He knows what to do. It's just a matter of whether or not he can execute the game plan. Ooh. Great usage of down tilt. Run up, stay to the safe distance. You know, Deku's could have done a get up attack and it would have hit him. That's what actually from Deku's as well. Doesn't get a whole lot out of it. And here comes the damage. But whoa! Actually ends up shield grabbing. And uh, getting a little bit of damage himself. I guess I'm expecting a, a bit bigger punishes from both players. I think uh, I'm liking what I'm seeing here from Apathy. Dekus is not getting the uh, the, the openings we saw versus his matchup, his yeah. previous match. But and it's understandable. I feel like Two Links a much harder character to get openings against. Ooh, throwing out the taunt. Oh, <laughs> was he? Was he? I think he went to attack him, but he didn't realize that he was also ta taunting. Three. I like I like these friendly taunts. Uh -huh. Instead Very of nice. taking advantage. Well, he took advantage of that long range of that <laughs> fair. Catching apathy as he was coming off of that platform. So Deku's needing to put in a little bit of work here uh, to be able to secure this first game. Apathy's sitting in a good position. If he can just keep doing what he's doing. Surprise Wizards, but the crab here is going to be some nice damage. I love Ooh. the dash back from Apathy. That was so important to avoid the fair. Because I think that the fair would have, uh, if it, it probably would have taken the stock, but it would have put Tekus in like a really favorable position. Oh, this this is a good position to be in, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Apathy secures game one. Uh, it's pretty is. much you know, going his way the whole time, so good stuff to him. He didn't give Deku's uh, many openings to work with. Just kind of relentlessly threw out the, the items to control the zones, let him get in. He's smiling right now, having a good time. Having a ball. Deku's looking very serious. As a good Ganymede should. Probably not satisfied with how game one turned out. Let's see if he can bring it together. What are you thinking? Smaller constricted? He did have good platform movement on the smaller stage from what I noticed earlier. Um, I think the problem is Toon Link's fast. Toon Link is a real quick character. So it just kind of, I think it depends. For me, it would be, I don't know if he feels this way, but... If someone's a really quick with their character, the smaller stages, they can be all up in your face the whole time, so it's harder to deal with. <laughs> so for anybody who likes Super Smash Bros. Melee, we're having a regional tournament this weekend. That's Dime. Right. Be so exciting. tune in to... Uh, well, that one's going to be on twitch.tv slash tourneylocator. 
get some good wholesome melee action. Oh my god, I just noticed. Over there, you, you might be able to see the, see the setup, but they have a uh, Pusheed next to a Suit Sprite. From uh, is that? Push, it's like a pink Pusheed next to a Suit Sprite. I don't know who's playing over there, but they make me happy. That, that is is wonder. It's and very cute. Wow, that was literally uh, the longest stage selection. But like we saw, small constricted stage, and the, the presence of these platforms means that Deku's going to be able to. I think be all over apathy. I in theory, in theory. Wow, what a start! Fair oh. double, fair. Taking that oh. real quick. Uh, I'll give him the fundies. <laughs> the fundies. Give the Can you reach out there? The cam on the camera? I can't. Okay. But know that I'll give him the fundies. Ooh, interesting using usage of that reflect. We saw that a couple of times. Stomp into the grab. And low percents, really smart option. Deck is going down a stock. Still with a good lead, but like we can see, especially when Apathy can play the projectile game and uh, cut off uh, and kind of play at a distance, he's able to make up yeah. the deficit. He did. He, he did real quick too. About 30 seconds, he brought the game back. Deku started out with an opening that we didn't see in the first game, so he can just do that a little bit more. And uh, some part DI from Deku's is going to result in him losing his stock. Apathy showing uh, a little bit of flash, flashy play. Tossing around the bombs. Oh, oh. oh. a little bit too flashy. A touch, just a touch. Sometimes we need to be humbled. And uh, I don't know if he'll go as crazy for the rest of the game anymore. But that's OK. That's what happens. Apathy creating a little bit of that separation and finally coming in with some of those disjoints. And Ooh. the sequencing of aerials there was was just something really to be marveled at. And then continuing along with that boomerang, getting a bit more extra damage before Deku's can use that up B, make it back onto the stage. He's put in this corner right now, and that's definitely not where somebody uh, like Ganondorf really wants to be. As we can see, using the side B Ooh. and coming up just short of recovering onto the stage. So I had my eyes over there on Apathy, and I was waiting to see what happened, but uh, Deku's just lost his stock. So, once again, in a deficit. Deku's is playing a character like Ganondorf, so like we're seeing now, it doesn't take a whole lot of hits to make it make the comeback happen. But how he's going to find the hits really is the question. That's Ooh. the opportunity. Apathy with an error in the item game gives Deku's all the time in the world that he needs. Starting the combo for Deku's. But it did not take the stock, which is very, very valuable. For oh him. my god! We saw. Wait, wait, wait. We saw the artifacts come out. Yeah, I don't. Strongman? Uh, Beijing <laughs> Strongman? What, what, what was that? Even Abdi can't believe he's saying that it was shiny. I should have taken <laughs> that stock. So sad. I, I haven't seen so anybody. Uh, that's just the crazy. Oh, we'll yeah. just pretend these guys know every little thing about the game. I haven't seen Dekus was counting the frames. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, that might have been really bad. You know, I, I've been commentating so much Smash 4 that I was about to say that rage is a factor, but one thing is certain this Ganon main is very angry. Getting the grab as well as the up smash. 66%, Ooh. but no! I didn't the think dare. he would just fall down. He'd fast fall down air, weaves through the platforms, and hit a Ganon. Good stuff to good stuff to Apathy. Deku's shaking his fist angrily. Yeah, I, actually I think becoming he, he Ganondorf to, for a second. He wanted to see a little bit better performance, but understandable. So, I mean, he, he had some really beautiful, beautiful moments uh, tonight. But uh, it, it's kind of sad to see him come up short in that second game, especially when he was making that comeback. Yeah, good stuff to Apathy. I, I, he had solid play. He had solid play throughout that set. A clean 2-0. So. I actually need to hop on.